This is probably all part of the Middlesex Canal infrastructure. Probably a good place to try to run the trail if it's doable. So we have this parking lot thing. Use you know, it as a shortcut since the river seems to be on the other side of it. on the other end. So yep, Wedsmere Station. And through that little tunnel I came. And now, with the mighty Aberjona merely over here, and it continues here, we'll see just how it's set up for following and how we might do so. the ever-present athletic fields. Yeah, I see a dragonfly or three. I'm amazed at how the insect photography people manage to get anything at all of those things. They're incredibly skittish. There's probably tricks of the trade, like catch them early on a cool morning when they're sluggish. They stay put longer. Geez, we just have endless trains. <laughs> Place is busy. Okay, oops, there's a plaque. Let's see what it has to tell us. Gin Field, or Gin maybe. Founder of Gin and Company Textbook Publishers. <laughs> So we came from there, and now we're attempting to follow the Aberjona, which is conveniently right here, bridged by another charming old stone thing. Traffic. It's the suburbs. So here we are down along the riverside. There really isn't much to connect to it. You can see the bank is pretty steep here. Amazing old tree up there. This is almost worth pulling out the zoom lens for. And it's just some sort of overlooked poison ivy mini wild, some kind or another. And this bridge over there. that thing of beauty or what? <laughs> yeah, it looks like we have possible buffer zones to run some trail through, I don't know. And there is the actual resumed trail just across the road 
the other side of this bridge. Here's some kind of runoff seeping into the watershed, presumably storm drains. Some little rise up from this funny little wasteland and get another cool stone bridge. Our traffic has subsided a bit. Kind of a busy little intersection. And here we have the resumption of the old MDC trail system. So it should be in Winchester, it's proper downtown, etc. Before I know it, the river and the railroad are over this way. And once more we have high functioning, well maintained basic sidewalk trail stuff of a piece with its counterpart further south of Medford. Oh, there's an old bench. <coughs> this will get you back to Medford eventually. And this brings you up into the exotic wilds of Woburn. Oh, look, a bit of Aberjona vantage. A glimpse of the athletic fields beyond, which you thankfully don't have to cross because athletic fields, if you're not athleting on them, are about as Interesting as dried paint or something. Ah, we have a nice further glimpse of the other side of the Aldstown Bridge and a sense of how the bank is steep. This was a home for canals. Still seems to have a significant number of storm drain entries, but I suppose I can't be helped. Ah, a little overlook. Evidently, they did some work on the channel and got it back to its approximate size when it was the Middlesex Canal. It's mostly routed along this forested buffer strip, as I mentioned before, and there's more of those great old MDC lampposts.
<laughs> it's another commuter for hell.